during these times of covid one thought which is on everyone's mind is when will the covid vaccine come now that's a good question to ask because nobody is uh, really sure the good news is that there are not 1 2 3 but probably about 10 different companies working on the covid vaccine uh, so i am confident that in the next 6 months to 1 year we will definitely have a covid vaccine but until then what can we do what can people with diabetes do the first thing of course is to look after your diabetes well and control it well because uncontrolled diabetes is definitely associated with poorer outcomes and even increased deaths and mortality due to covid-19 but there is something else that you can do in the absence of a covid vaccine there are a couple of other vaccines which you can take which may not prevent covid-19 but if you get a secondary infection in the lung then that can be prevented the commonest infection that you get is pneumonia and this can be prevented by taking pneumococcal vaccination pneumococcal vaccination the good news is that you need to take it only once if you take it once you are protected lifelong so if you have taken it in the last say 2 or 3 years is probably uh, it's not probably it's not necessary to repeat that uh, pneumococcal vaccination but if you have not had it for many years or if you are at an older age group or if you have diabetes it's a very good idea to have a pneumococcal vaccination done it's a simple vaccination and if you take it you're protected throughout your life from getting pneumococcal pneumonia which is one of the commonest forms of pneumonia the other vaccination which i would highly recommend for all people and especially for those with diabetes and those who are at an older age group is influenza vaccination unlike the pneumococcal vaccination the influenza vaccination has to be taken every year because it is valid only for one year and so if you have not had it in the last one year i would recommend that you have an influenza vaccination also now how does this help at least it will prevent you from getting the usual cough cold etc due to influenza now if on top of that if you get covid obviously the results are not going to be so good also since you're going to be protected from the normal flu and so on if you develop those symptoms it is more likely to be covid you may ask is there any other vaccination which person with diabetes should take apart from the pneumococcal vaccination and the influenza vaccination hepatitis b vaccination also is recommended because people often get cuts or wounds or they may have a blood transfusion or you may be going to a laboratory where there could be some cross infect uh, cross infection and so on and so forth and therefore taking hepatitis b vaccination is also recommended but the first two the pneumococcal vaccination and the influenza vaccination is a definite must for all people with diabetes for people who have uh, lower immunity for people who are at older age groups and if you have any other coexisting illnesses then it is better to take at least a pneumococcal vaccination and the influenza vaccination thank you